Hey everybody on YouTube, this is a review of the new iPod Nano, fourth generation. Just bought it yesterday, um, right before the Apple Store closed, as a matter of fact. Um, it's a very, very awesome device. Um, just compare it to size with the first generation. Look how much uh, thinner that is. It's like it, it's almost like half the thickness, and um, the user interface is like completely different. Um, but it's a really awesome device. I love the accelerometer. You can uh, just tilt it over like that, and it uh, it'll bring up your album artwork and stuff. It's pretty cool. And then you can just click on it just like the normal iPod and it brings it back. Um, it's got the, let's see, <clears throat> if I go to songs, oh, photograph by Nickelback. Um, I can shuffle my songs by going like that, and uh, it just shuffled to a new song. That's pretty cool. Um, I don't care what anybody says, that's awesome. <laughs> um, and then, the game, it comes with a accelerometer based game on it. It's kind of cool. It, it's called Maze. I forgot what it was called. Um, basically, the idea of the game is to just move the ball around. I don't know if you can see it, but the ball just moves around with the accelerometer and you have to pick up stuff and everything. It's pretty simple. Um, I would recommend you buy some games off of iTunes for it. Um, and then it's got the Vortex and the Klondike, just like the old one. Um, I r really like the video quality on this thing. Oh, let me get a G4 podcast here. Uh, let's do the LG Dare, because the phone's awesome. Better than the iPhone, by the way. Uh, see that video quality? It's just... I don't know if you can tell on YouTube, but it's just, I mean, it's stunning for what it is. Um, <clears throat> this is the 8 gig model because so far they're not selling the 16 gig yet. Um, and then the now playing screen is really awesome. Let's just give you a, let's see the now playing screen. It looks, it kind of has the flavor of an iPod Touch. And if I hold down the uh, center button, it'll bring up my start. It says Start Genius, Add to On the Go Playlist, um, Browse Album, and Browse Artists, and Cancel. I love Genius because I'm going to hit Genius, and it brings me up a playlist of songs that sound like, um, in this case, Don't by Blink 182. Um, just an amazing device in my opinion. Great animations. I love the album artwork scrolling down the bottom of the screen. It's to me it's better than the way it was on the old one. Um, and I love the new design that they brought back because in my opinion that old Nano, <laughs> the third generation looked like a piece of junk. It was butt ugly. But this one is really nice. Um the screen, nice and large and bright, um, does everything that Apple says it will do, and it, so far the battery life is really good. I've been using it all day, and I've got that much battery left. I don't know if you can see it, <coughs> but it's, uh, it's really awesome, and I would totally recommend it. It'll, it'll set you back 150 bucks, but that's <coughs> not a big deal, really. Um, and I, even if you've got a third generation, I'd recommend you upgrade to this thing because it's just awesome. And again, here's the, the first generation size comparison. It's a little taller, the new one, but it's what you get. It's a bigger screen, so, I mean, and it's really, really thin. I don't know if you can see it, but it's like, I mean, from this angle, it's like half the thickness of the first generation, so... Um, it's, it's really great. I love it. See ya. Bye.